God code. So let's talk about faith. Hebrews 11 verse 1. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Life starts with a choice to do something. And it can be really random. But that's in the eyes of man. Remember, God says, Before you were formed in your mother's womb, He ordained you. So the person you should become is already set in destiny, tied in the strings of God's will. Sometimes, we can't make sense of it. Sometimes we can see where we are going and why we are going there. But that's natural. That's how we react to life because we are humans. But if we just focus, pay attention to what we should get done, do our part, and then let God do his part. As I heard a speaker said, it's not what you go through in life, it's how you decide to frame it. So we have to make that decision that, okay, we are going to step towards something. We are going to seek to achieve the better version of ourselves. What that is, that is in the unknown. So it starts with a step. You know, a baby creeps before they walk. And they walk before they run. And they run before they jump. So life comes in stages. Don't miss out on the journey. Because you are trying to focus on the end game. There is a beginning for everything. You have to be willing to start at zero. Because that's where every cone starts. Zero cones, one cones, two cones, three cones. There can never be a ten without the one or without the zero. So what are you waiting for? Don't be caught up in your fears. Don't be caught up in everything that tell you that you cannot do this thing. Think about it. What if? What if you try? You know, you try to fail if you fail to try. So the best approach is to try to achieve something. It's better to try than to do nothing at all. Come on, lift your spirit. This is the day that the Lord has made. Rejoice and be glad in it. We don't know what the day holds, but we are going to hope. As Hebrews 11 verse 1 says, Faith is not what we can see. It's the hope for something. The reaching for a pattern for our lives that we can follow a structure come on don't give up life can be so great depending on how we view it there are so many people suffocating from their own talents from their own vision living mentally and never to step forward on the physical plane of life to really see what it would look like if what's in their head plays out in their reality. God did not give us a spirit of fear but of love, kindness, bold spirit. You know, come on, let's just try who knows where it's gonna go?
paint the picture. God does the framing. Believe.